Hey guys, so I've had this kayak now for three months and this last time that I tried using it, um, the steering broke and I'm not sure what happened there, it just, I was turning and I heard a snap in the handle and then lost all steering, but luckily I had my paddle and could steer with that all the way back. But yeah, I've only had three problems with the kayak so far. And that's definitely something that's broken and needs to be repaired. I'm not sure if that's a problem that all people will have. Okay, so one of the problems I've had with the rudder is it's something snapped on the inside. So you can turn it one way but not the other. Let's see if I pull it all this way. You can see that it turns. And you can go all the way to the right and it doesn't move it at all. So on the back here, you've got these two things and I think one of them's come off on the inside of this handle. But I'm just going to open that up and uh, we'll take a look. Okay. So yeah. Looks like the cable rusted and broke. Or I don't know if it rusted. It's just... it broke. So I'm gonna take a picture of this and send it off to Riot and see if they'll replace it. So one of the... one of the things that can go wrong with the kayak is if you lean too far back. Let's see if I can do it here. There you go. So if you lean too far back, this switch here will invert. So a quick way to fix that is just pull out the string, flip it back, and then push it through again. And it's all good. Or did I do it backwards? Yeah, okay, so there you go. So that's not bad. I thought this was a, a bad thing about it, but it seems to be a quick fix. Easy to do out the, on the water. And then the third issue I've had with this kayak in the past three months is that just the, the pedal drive, it, it kind of shifts back and forth like when you're pushing it but it's not too big of a deal i think if i just put on some foam it'll be fine so i submitted a claim to riot for warranty since i've only had this for three months and it's been a couple weeks now and i still had no response i emailed them and called them and left messages and just nothing i wanted to get back out there so i've had to repair the kayak myself Figured I'd try and replace the cable that broke with some regular bicycle cables. Okay, so based on this, it looks like somehow something inside here chafes on this wire and broke this. So I'm not sure if that's going to happen again. But I went on Amazon and I ordered this whole pack of um, bicycle brake wires. It was only five bucks, so hopefully I won't have to do this too often, but if it if this does solve it, I'll just buy some good ones. Because one thing I notice, the uh, wires that, that come with this, they're coated in plastic. So it doesn't look like this will cause any friction. That's good. So it's threading through there pretty good.
turned the handle so it's all the way to the one side because this will be the most amount of wire that we're going to need. You just need to take off these two and then that'll loose that'll loosen this all up and you don't actually need to mess with this at all. I do need to trim these but I don't have uh, any of my cutters. So there I've replaced the two wires and um, I had to do both of them because the gauge of wire that they used before was different from the stuff that I got. And it seems to work okay. Um, much better than before actually. Yes. Believe it or not, that's a lot better. Used to be so much tighter. I think the problem with these kayaks is the gauge of wire that they're using for the steering is too thick. So I'm probably going to have to repair this over and over again, but luckily I bought a 10 pack of these bicycle brake cables for 5 bucks on Amazon, so cost isn't going to be too much of a factor. It's just going to be time. So yeah, it's pretty unfortunate that Riot has such bad customer service, but Maybe I'll hear back from them, but after two weeks and hearing nothing, I'm, I'm not expecting anything. I really should have got the Hobie instead of getting the uh, better electronics and this one. That was my whole rationale for getting one of these because it's like, because it was about $800 cheaper and I got to get the sonar with the side scan and I should, probably should have got a better kayak. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I'll tr try this out and I guess maybe I'll do a six month review or let you know as I go.